Yes. So that's a confidential document. Every council has seen it. Mr. Svande, have you seen it? I've seen the document, my lord. Mr. Mgomezul? I've seen it. I have not. Mr. Mnesi? I've seen it, my lord. Lolik? I've seen it. Mr. Mshololo? I've seen it. Right, the second one. Have you shown it to your clients? Correct, my lord. I've seen it so many times. And that is so, my lord. However, there was a bit of an issue here. The client is saying this document is to be used here at court. He requests that copies of that document. What's your client? Yes. Tell him about the Official Secrets Act. Uh, is it please a court, my lord? I'm convinced. Mr. Mshololo, have you shown it to your client? Yes, my lord. Okay, thanks. Then we can go on. Thank you, Mr. Amini. It is very my lot. No. Uh, we agree that it's soil. I have confirmed. It's confirmed. <laughs> okay. Yes. If you can now demonstrate what you intended to demonstrate with the document. It was purely for illustrative purposes to show you a tower and that the vicinity or the radius of the distance is around the tower. So in other words, if I understand you, it the directional impinging of the device and it's picked up by the tower. It doesn't depend on the direction. Are you with me? Yes. Meaning, like me, for instance, I'm, I'm facing south. The radius is round. Yeah. So the direction is irrelevant. Whether yes. you are east, west, south, or north, as long as you're within the vicinity to impinge on the tower, it will trigger. That, that is correct, my lord. But also bear in mind that on the towers there's antennas. Yes. Okay. Okay. Are you done now with illustrating with the document? Yes. Mm. Okay. On exhibit DD five E, Roman figure one, I only limited your evidence to page five only. From page one to page five. Yes. The defense can go up to page 105, it's fine, but let's for our purposes, let's stick to these pages. Sure. More especially on the on page 4 and 5. Page 4 and 5. We indicated that the indicators in this page is undefined as well as Queenswood NGA. And as well as the activities are going and incoming calls. That's correct, yes. And I come back on a forty who form a working on the Buya, no more on to your phone. In some, yeah, in some instances. Incoming SMSs and outgoing SMSs as well as call forwards. Correct. So now, in conclusion, would you say that this device was in use within the vicinity of Queenswood throughout page 2, 3, 4, and 5? That is correct, yes. Do you have any other 
evidence that you want to relate to the court at this stage? Yeah. But no further questions in the for this witness. Thanks. Uh, I'll commence my cross examination by taking you back on the cell phone that you have received for the purpose of downloading. Uh, you mentioned uh, eight cell phones that you have received. Objection, my lord. So, this witness <laughs> does not deal with downloading of cell phones. There was never a evidence that she downloaded or she received cell phones for purposes of downloading. Yes, you, sorry, may I rephrase it? You received a letter from the SAPS to assist them with the Say, when you received that letter from the SAPS, you were requested to yes. so, thank you. you were requested to provide in terms of section 205 to provide the data for the information contained in the cell phone. Remember saying that. If you can provide me with the numbers of the cell phones, I can confirm if we have received subpoenas on that. The first number is 060804. Which document are you reading from? I'm reading from uh, JJ Triple J1. Yes. I'm just checking the page where you mentioned the eight cell phones that you were requested in section two or five on. Was it? Was it? Sorry. I don't know. I'm trying to understand. This, this witness makes a request, as you say, for rent. She provides data consisting of particular cell phone numbers. Correct. That's it. Thank you, man. That's the question. Do you, do you have this, the cell phone numbers? that you were requested to make data on in terms of section 25. Yes, the numbers appear on triple check, exhibit triple check, uh, J1, page number 3. <laughs> So I just want to go on those cell phones one by one. <coughs> you said the number 0608040436, it belonged to, to cell 12. That is correct. Thank you, Your Honor. The number of the recommended would be Laga Silo 12. So the number 082704. 4358, it belonged to Telekuma. Correct. The number 072938 it belonged to Telekuma. Correct. 
the number 071-437-9551. Belong to Senzo. May you. Correct. Can you assist me with the number 073-114-5039-35? Who does it belong to? <clears> 071? <throat> 073? Yes. 114? <clears throat> Do you have the set of data, 4,649 pages? If you have the full data, the RICA information should reflect on that set of data. Yes. Who does it belong to this number? I do not have the full set of data, and I cannot read that offhand. <laughs> So the number <clears throat> the number O seven four six seven six triple six nine. Do you know who does it belong to? My Lord, if we had the full set of data consisting of 4,600 pages, I would be able to mention who the RICA details belong to. I have it on my computer, but I don't know if the, the court has a copy of that full data. Yeah, are you with the witness? I'm with the witness. Yeah, the witness is basically saying... The request was for data which encompasses 4,409 pages. Yes, I'm with the witness. But when she gives evidence, she extrapolates. Am I, if I'm lying, just tell me. That she is extrapolates correct. numbers which are relevant to the state's <coughs> case to say this number had an interaction with that number. That's correct. Yeah, but that's she my... says if you give her 4,409 pages. <coughs> She'll be able to tell you this number belongs to so and so and so and so. All right. Let me just put it this way. The number that I just gave you now, 0746766669, it belongs to Zandi Kumar. Just when I have a look on Zandi my doc Kumar. document. O seven four number. O seven four six seven six. Triple six nine. Okay. Does it belong to Zandi Kuman? Zandi Kuman. I cannot confirm that because I do not have that on my statement. As I've indicated, if I have the full set of data, I can then either confirm or decline. It's the easiest way. It's not that. Maybe we should adjourn so that you get. The whole data, now, according to the witness. Otherwise, she says if she doesn't have the full data, she's not able to say that. That's this number. Where, that's somewhere I'm going to, my lord. That's why I'm asking this. Uh, uh, we don't need an adjournment. Mm. If you don't have that number, it's fine. But my question is, you let evidence about the numbers of Kelly Kumalo and Lomo Toyo. We have a good number of people who are going to be So, in other words, there was a selection of certain numbers that you were to assist on a particular date. Is that correct? My Lord, I was actually given the data to testify from. And that is what I've testified from, given evidence on. 
should there be something that I'm asked about and that is not here, then it was not handed to me. Sorry, Mr. Sbani, when, when we were adjourning and re going up and down, didn't you give the defense the whole kaput, the whole data? When did we disclose the data? The data, we mean 4,000 plus pages, they have it. disclosed in the That's it. That's how I remember the evidence. That every council here. <laughs> And yes. my lord, just to take the point further, what uh, my colleague is asking, Exhibit O speaks to these questions that are being asked with this witness. Where can a stain identify these numbers by employing different methods? To say this number belongs to Zandi Kumalo of one, two, three reasons. The number belongs to Kili Kumalo of one, two, three reasons. Just to take it further, when uh, Advocate Minisi wanted to raise the very same point. It was advocate uh, Mr. Mgomei Zulorada who said that this number belonging to Kaylee's, they already been um, mentioned in an affidavit. Now, I think you don't understand me. Sorry, my lord, to interject. I don't think you understand me. My question was, you only led evidence in relation to the cell phones that were given to you to assist on the numbers for Kaylee Kuman and the one for uh, long and twine. That's the evidence that you let in this court. There's not any other evidence of a cell phone relating to Zandi Kumal, Gladness Kumal, um, Togo Zisitwala, and, and the rest, the people that were in the house. The relevant part of what I'm asking is your testimony dealt with the information that was contained in the cell phone of Kelly Kumal and long and twine. That's the relevance of this question. <coughs> Let us move on. There's one thing that before I proceed with my first examination, I, <coughs> my colleague, I think it was Mr. Advocate Baloy, <coughs> made a correction or put it to you that the number 060 um, the first number that I gave you, 0608040436. He clarified it by saying it did not belong to Silotwa, like belong to Longotwa. Remember? Do you remember saying that? Yes. Yes, I want to put it to you that it was not your evidence that this number belonged to belong to Silo Twala, but it was in possession of Long Twala. That was not your evidence. If you look at my addendum, on the um, Rika, it says Selo Twala. Yes. Mauguga Vulengo Diame, Yona, Yveza U Selo Twala. Yes, I remember what you said. You said it belonged to Selo Twala. But you never gave evidence, unless I'm quoting you wrong, to say this number belonged to Long Twala. You never gave such evidence. I was never asked who the user or this number belonged to. I merely went with the information that reflects on our RECA um, database. That's the reason why I'm asking this. Because I heard my colleague saying this number was actually used by Longo Twala. It actually belonged to Silo Twala, not Longo Twala. My colleague put it to you 
But my, the, the, the point that I'm driving to is, it is not your evidence that this 060 number, you did not place it on record that it, it belonged to Long Etoile. That is correct. We have so, in this regard, it is highly possible that a, a, a cell phone or a particular uh, uh, cell phone is record in somebody's name and be used by another person. That is highly possible, correct? That is correct, yes. What is so the presumption behind this is that a person, if he is not identified, if the state did not put it to you, that number was used by Longwetwala, one would still believe that that number, since it is recorded by, in the name of Silo Twala, that means Silo Twala was in possession of the cell phone. In my evidence, I refer to as the cell phone numbers, the ending of the cell phone numbers, and not by anyone's name. I can only go with what reflects on our set of data. But men, the only inference, I cannot say the only inference, but the inference could be that <coughs> if this number 060804 was recorded in the name of Silo Twala and this number is <clears throat> registered in one of the towers in Fos Loras. The presumption was that that Silotola was in Fos Loras. <coughs> Will I be correct to say that? No. Remember, we don't know who has the cell phone. Correct, yes. So basically, <laughs> it's the tower that picks up the cell phone and not the person. Correct. My question, I'm still with that question. There are so many things that you need to clarify, especially that will also benefit accused number two. I'm saying this number, 060-804-0436, it is recorded in the name of Silotwala. Correct. Yes. This number was registered in one of the towers in first lawyers. I'm just giving you an example, but it's part of the evidence. Correct? Correct. The inference that you can draw is that the person, or say, sorry, this number or this device, at that time it was registered, it was in possession of a person who owns it, who is recorded in the name of the I cannot confirm that because the person using that handset is unknown to me. I can only speak about the handset and which tower picked up the handset. Yes. 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 Now, as you say, this number was recorded in the name of Silotwan. All right? Mm -hmm. please, please follow me. It's recorded in the name of Silotwan. According to the evidence that have led regarding this number, one cannot say Silotwala was in first numbers unless 
the contrary is apparent. For instance, the state has given, has, has said to you, this number was in possession, the device was in possession of Longo Toala. That's where the, the apparent, the contrary is. Because in terms of what was the information contained in the tower, it, it shows the number, not the person. But when you follow the number, the number tells you that it has been recorded in the name of Silotuan. But according to the evidence that you are leading, uh, Silotuan, I can confirm that he was not in, in Fos Lodas. I, ca I cannot confirm that because I have no idea. I'd like you to keep it in the back of your mind. I'll come back to this question again. Because it, it, it has its own principle that needs to be, to be addressed before this honorable court. Let's proceed. This number, 060-804-0436, was used by Longwetwala according to Advocate Baloy. And this number, is there any evidence whereby you can link this number with the number of Kelly Kuman or both the numbers of Kelly Kuman, <coughs> the 072 number and the 083 number? 072 and the 082 number. Is there any possibility, if we, even if I, we can adjourn to look for that number, if there was a communication between these two numbers or these three numbers? I want to establish if Kelly Kumalo had a conversation with Long Etwala. I think it's important um, to make reference to the evidence that I have given. Yeah. We actually went through all the call data that might have been relevant at that time. And I feel that if we need to establish that, then Mr. Mugamazulu uh, needs to identify that transaction on this whole set of data. And then I can be then um, refer to those activities and maybe elaborate what kind of an activity it is. But in, in doing so, you will have to go through that entire set of data, look for what is relevant for you, and then I can then answer your questions, if that makes sense. Yes, it, it makes sense what you are saying. But, uh uh, there's, there's a certain document they are looking for. Okay. All right. In terms of... Okay, thank you. Ma'am, I'm in possession of this letter. My Lord, I didn't make copies of this letter, or maybe I should... Make... Whose letter is it? It's a letter from Captain... Uh, Captain, yeah. So, my lord, it's a letter from Captain Muteto, who has who wrote a letter requesting the two fives for the people that were in the house. Yes, yeah, okay, fine, this here. Yes, my lord. Uh, in, in fact, I didn't make copies. No, fine. Uh, may I Are you going to hand it up for evidence? For because evidence. apparently here we've got problems with handing things for evidence. My lord, at the moment, this letter is coupled with an affidavit, but the affidavit is not attached in, no, fine. in this. But I'm going to hand up that letter. Yes, I can hand That's up this letter. 
I'm requesting the, the witness to to have a look on on this letter. Will you agree with me that it's a letter that was written by Captain Teto with Kenel Mdise requesting the 205s for the numbers that appeared in that document? Yes, it does. At least um, a number of cell phone numbers. Yes, I request you to place the contents of that letter on record. Do you want me to read the entire letter? The, yes. Okay, so it comes from the Office of the Provincial Commissioner, Provincial Investigating uh, Unit, Detective Service, which is in Gauteng. DPCI Notebook Analysis, South African Police, Corner Diagonal and Pritchard Streets, Johannesburg. Request for Section 205, Results Analysis, Charge Murder, Fosloris, CAS 636, 10 of 2014. The victim is Senzo Robert Mayiwa, uh, Bafana, Bafana, Bafana Goalkeeper. It then states description of the incident. On 2014 1026, at 2000 hours, I need to make mention that some of the alphabets are erased on this document. Um, and I will pass over those words. Un unknown black males stormed at house number 13511, Kutla Nong Street, Mzamo, looks like section, sprayed view. One armed with a firearm and demanded belongings of the people in the house. There were seven people in the house who all had cell phones in their possession. Commotion ensued amongst the suspects and the occupants of the house during which one victim by the name of Senzo Miwa was shot once on the chest and died. The suspects then fled on foot. The following paragraph states the following are the cell phone numbers of the witnesses at the crime scene. 060-306-5201 to Melo, I would think it's Matladla. Matladla. 074 67 Zandile Kumalo. 0827044358. And 70293. It's erased. It continues with 2498 in brackets Kelly Kumalo 073-114-5035 um, Ntombi could be Gladness Kumalo 071-437-9851 Senzo Miwa deceased 060-804-5035 Longwe Twala 076-455-2119 and Toko ZC Twala 079-106-9100 Mandisa could be Mkise deceased wife was not at the crime scene in brackets following paragraph states the following numbers were obtained from downloading of some of the witness cell phones and section 205 were applied for and when the downloadings were analyzed there were some numbers that were picked up in order could be to establish if they were at the crime scene on the date of the incident in brackets it says downloading results 
looks like the word sealed in forensic bag PA 600-221-0561. It then gives reflex cell phone numbers which are 076-904-9532. Thereafter, Zero seven eight double two eight two seven six nine zero seven six three zero five zero double five nine zero seven six seven three five two five three six. It continues on the following page to zero seven. I have no idea what that number is. One zero eight two. Two five two zero zero eight two six two six seven six three two zero eight two five double nine five three two five. Lastly, zero seven six five one double six three four nine. It then goes on to state the GP numbers of the above cell phone numbers are as follows: in brackets, sealed in forensic bag number PA. Six double zero double two one zero double five nine. Below listed is GP two eighty of ten two thousand and fourteen, GP fifty seven of one two thousand and fifteen, GP fifty eight of one two thousand and fifteen, GP two sixty five of two two thousand and fifteen. The next paragraph says the GP numbers of section 205 results for the above witnesses are sealed in forensic bag PA 600-221-0558 as per GP 567-10-2014, of GP 568-10-2014, GP 569 of 10 2014, GP 156 of 8 2015, GP 157 of 8 2015, GP 213 of 8 2015. Next paragraph states section 205 was also done by using crime scene towers, results from Vodacom, are sealed in forensic bag number PA 600-221-0560. Other information followed during investigation, section 205 results, as per GP 4311-2014, GP 7111-2014, and lastly, GP 72-11-2014, all sealed as per forensic bag PA 600-221-0508. It then states all the, data all the provided data is collectively sealed in one forensic bag PA 400 one seven five two four six uh, six four. It then goes on to say, kindly assist this office in uh, analyzing the provided data. Further information can be obtained from Sergeant Mushwana, DPCI analysis section, and then it's signed by Colonel M. H. Modise. Provincial Investigating Unit Commander Gauteng. Thank you. Um, I just want to request the, that exhibit to be marked, I think, Triple J. Triple? Eight, triple J. <coughs> eight. Or eight. If, if not nine. What was the last one? <coughs> triple J. Eight, man. Okay.
lengwati lena i lengwati ya ikelwa amakoi sakantila amakoi sababe kela ukuthi maku yenzwe ama download ku lezi nombo kanti kwa ku u kenele mchetwa no 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 mudise kanti kutuwa kwa ku 14 2014 let's say this is at October yet to what about eight Uwinto tenga ziwa, ii ama tota. Awa nga ziwa, wafige ba telega pagati indini. E13511. Kutwa nung street in Zamo, section spread view. Ba abeto me nge ipa mkanti ba afiga, ba se, ba afiga ba gena pagati, kutwa kwa kwa pagati ba se ba tipa kuna ezi nge ezi tize. Leze ipetwe ilaba ntuba nga paga. Laba wantu laba wabi batatwe kipe pagati endle. Kanti kute masi befiga pagati bekele leze zintu kutubaya zifuna. Kwa se kukala unga zwani noma kwa tanda hindi. Gada suskati abantu beko nga pagati. Kanti usenzo mewa wase wea tujulo wa shona. A labo bantu laba baba ngene pagati ndini Basu ke ba kuma pekichi mange nyawa Kanti ama cell phone numbers laba wabe kon pagati Kwa kui 06030652013 tumele Matlala 074676669 Uh, 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 0720435809 
of 2014, GP557 of 1, 2015, GP58 of 1, 2015, GP265 uh, uh, of 2, 2015. EGP section, uh, section of 205. I'm a result. But what fagger who P A six double zero double two one zero five five zero. They say about one of our group, a GP back back five six seven ten twenty fourteen five six eight ten twenty fourteen five six seven ten Two thirteen eight twenty fifteen. Ogwe anga lomte to two o five. Blau ma download. Why is the government tower was say a waga voda com? Base one. Afa wagu p a w p a six double zero two two one zero five six zero. E mi ni e mi ni ni mwanu ogwe anga two o five. Guaba i the G P four three. 11 of 2014, GP 71, 11 of 2014, uh, GP 72, 11 of 2014. We are now going to PA 622, 6002, 105508. We are going to office. Ugua pay, but pay, but not the office of Ugua pay. Thank you. A lot for a point of correction, it's triple J9. Just want to mark it triple J9. to handle this exhibit. But uh, my colleagues will request the copies to be made for them. Then no, no, I can make copies first. I Let can make first. copies first then. Thank you, Lord. May I proceed? Mm -hmm. Thank you, ma'am. So <clears throat> it is confirmed in, term, in terms of the exhibit that the, the request was made in respect of people that were in the house. Yes, it did state so. And your evidence is only limited to three people that were in the house. The evidence that you were led in this court on, it, it dealt with the late Senzo Mayo, uh, Kelly Kumano, and, and the long way to Allah. That's the evidence that you have led. But the request was made in respect of eight people. Do you agree? Yes. We have room which you got to a nice scatty them trailer, barbe trailer, which you go to a madam who love a band, Nava Bank, and a package in the court, a year and a four as in Jenna, and a band of a child. Yes, ma'am, according to the evidence of the defense for accused number one and other witnesses for the defense. There was a communication between Tumilo Mashala and Mr. Edward Shaw. Mr. Mashala was in the house, and Edward Shaw, who is the brother in law of Senza Mayo, immediately after Senza was shot. 
And that, I will object to that question. <coughs> Unless if my colleague can pull out the record and point out where in the evidence did Mr. Tumelo Mazala said he did communicate with Mr. Edward Shope. My Lord, I didn't say it's an evidence of the state. I've indicated that the defense will give evidence that there was a communication between Tumelo Mazala and Edward Shope. Mm. That's what the defense will say. And my concern is that how can I prove in terms of section 205 that there was such a communication if that evidence was not provided by the state or was not provided in court? I cannot answer that because you will have to ask the state why it wasn't provided in court. Because the two five of the two five of Tumelo uh, Mashala, you were not given for you to give evidence to this court as to who was he communicated communicating with on the day since he was killed. Correct. I wasn't requested for such information. Same applies to Zandile Kumalo, <coughs> Gladness Kumalo, and Togos is in Togos is same applies to them. They were in the house, you were not provided with the information to give it as evidence in this court. Correct. May I just confirm this, my Lord, with my <coughs> Thank you, ma'am. Thank you, my lord. There is there's a question that I wanted to or an information that I wanted to relate to you, that Kelly Kumalo he made a call and he called Silo Twangu after the incident, on the day of the incident when she was at the hospital. And that evidence has not been led by the state. But I'll go through the section 205 of, of Kelly Kumalo for both numbers. What is important here is that there is an information that is deliberately omitted by the state because that evidence is crucial. We need to know which number did Kelly Kumalo use to phone Silo Twan amongst the 072 or the 072 numbers. But we'll get into that. Ma'am, I just want us to go straight to the relevant evidence relating to the, to the allegations against these five accused persons. And according to the evidence that you have led in terms of the 205s, you led evidence of the 205 under triple GG2. Let me just confirm it. No. 
right. Let me just put it this way. There's evidence that will let, according to accused number three, sorry, triple G1, relating to the cell phone of accused number three, which was registered in, in the name of accused number three. I think it's seven oh seven six double seven double six number uh, eight one six nine. Which set of data does it reflect on? Which exhibit? I'll give you now. I just want to, I'm looking for the exhibit. Just, well, it's triple G1. G1. Triple G1. From page 10 to page 13. Page 10 to page? Yes, from page 10 to page 13. 13? Yes. Okay, I have that here in front of me. May I confirm if that number is 076 7 It's a 072 number. Oh, so is it 072 7 double 6? 072-766-8169. I beg your pardon, 072-766-8169. Thank you. I just want to confirm that number. I'll make reference to other relevant uh, exhibits. All right. In this, in this case, the court is sitting to hear evidence relating to the incident that happened on the 26th of October 2016, uh, 2014, all right? And in terms of this exhibit, this is an exhibit of a 205 that was taken from the cell phone of actress number three, uh, Mr. Nubi, all right? Okay. And I want to relate that what is contained in that uh, information in the 205 with the 205 of Kelly Kuman on both numbers, the 082 and the 072. Because here, <coughs> ma'am, there is a confession which was accepted in this court. And that confession, it deals with a communication between accused number three and Kelly Kuman. Uguyanga lays a number, lay 072, na lay 018. And to put to a quaba corner, ne confession, lay a yantra. Number three. Can't you lay your confession? Even, even. Not a confession by accused number three. <coughs> it's an, a confession made by accused number two, alleged. Alleged. Number two. What was who corner? What is a liaison? A confession. Yeah. I'm not sure if the interpreter is interpreting. May I rephrase it? Please. In terms of this exhibit G3, triple G1, this is the 205 of accused number 3. Lena, is it a lazy science of your own title with 205 or number 3? Yes. And there is um, an exhibit, I think it's triple G1. Pune exhibit triple K one that deals with the section two o fives. They have they have they have the land and the long chat way two o five. 
concerning Kelikuma, those numbers. My Lanane, number of Kelikuma. Do you follow me? Yes. Would we have to say something? According to the, the state, accused number two made a confession. Who number two? Who we are confessing? Who number two? Who are participating in confession? In that confession, it states that accused number three was communicating with with Kelly Kumar. Who they are confessing? Who what? Who number three? Why the concern of Kelly Kumar? Do you follow me? Yes. In terms of the communication, it is said that Kelly Kumalo phoned accused number three. Who be an confession? Who to a who Kelly Kumalo? We are now phone number three and asked him as to where <coughs> where were they? Who are who to a who are booza? Okay, you got it. And the answer was. CC, we are on our way. Kanti impendulo yati kuche CC CC ndele. Okay, that's what is in the confession. He logo kuna paga chile confession. You would agree with me. I I understand that according to, but it's not according to your evidence. There's evidence that Kelly Kumalo was using six numbers, but that shall be confirmed. What you did? Who's again with you? Kelly Kumalo. Why name number is six? But what you did give as evidence related to two cell phones that belong to Kelly Kumalo. But what we are now looking for is that we are not going to be able to get the number of the number of Correct. Now, I would like to take you on Exhibit Triple G1 from page 10. I am on page 10. Yes. My lady, I will, I will object at this stage. I do not recall the confession statement stating on which number was that communication coming from, or how many cell phones was accused number three, or anyone killing on that particular day. So it is unfair for Mr. Mgomezul to ask this witness to compare such information with Exhibit Table G2. Yeah, but me, as I'm following the evidence, Mr. Gomez is insinuating that the statement, according to, I'm quoting you, Mr. Gomez Yes. The statement of accused number two, that's number two phone, or allegedly phone K. No, it's number three. Number three phone K. Yes. You are now insinuating that that is the truth. No. Hello. Oh, no. Yeah. Let's listen to me. You are saying because it's a confession and number three is said to have phoned K by the person who made the confession, that bit of evidence, it is truth. Are you with me? No, I'm with you. Okay, fine. As long as you, you hear what I'm saying. But what I'm relating to this court is that mm. the communication, you are trying to disprove that this, the contents of this uh, confession were true. Yes, you're right. Yes. Because now, it doesn't follow that uh, that confession, all of it is the truth. For instance, and I'm not creating evidence, I was listening attentively to Sergeant Mohona, Mohona the lady, yes. who said when they read that confession, they found that it contained inaccuracies because there was evidence that the alleged two or three other persons who are allegedly involved in the matter of Senzo Sorry were that. at that time in jail. Are you with me? It related to accused number one. Yeah, but I'm just saying, one of the confessions, yes. when they read it, 
they established that uh, it can't be true because some of the persons alluded to in that confession were actually in jail. <laughs> may, may, may I just add? Okay, <coughs> let us leave it. Yes, and go on. Uh, uh, go on, go let on. Let me go on. Yeah. I'm trying to address the, the concern of yes, yes. colleague, Mr. Advocate. Okay, Spine. fine. <coughs> that confession, it relates to the communication on the day Senzo was killed. It was specific. Who the confession? He could make a cigar, the Maidana, Nepulu, the Yayan Zeka, Madidana, who sends the Ezo show. So, in terms of the evidence that we have led in this court, including Kenan, Lieutenant Kenan Holmes, about the section 205 of accused number three, they relate to the incident of the 26th of October. 2014. Do you understand? And furthermore, the confession the alleged confession you are related the related to the incident of the 26th of October 2014. And your evidence, together with Mr. Hose's evidence, it, it relates to the communication to the 205s. As per exhibit triple G1. And, and triple J2. So what is relevant in this is that this communication by accused number three it deals with a concussion that at a later stage the court will make a conclusion whether such a confession was was the true reflection of what it was confessed about. My Lord, I would like yeah, to okay. object here. I don't know. Can the witness be asked questions? Because he's under cross examination. He's not here to assess evidence. No, it, 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 it doesn't help. Because he has been putting propositions to the, to the witness. I'm okay, no, Mr. Gomez, I'm not stopping you from putting yes. that. At the back of my mind, hmm. I yeah. know that section 2, is it 319? 219, yes. Two, one, two, two, nine. Nine. yes, you're aware of what I'm getting to. That's correct, yes. Yeah, that the evidence of a confession yes. by one accused yes. is not admissible against another well, accused. I'm, I'm, I'm now I'm, you're asking this witness to comment on an alleged allegation which was made by one person who deposed your confession. All right, I understand. Are you with me? I'm with you. <laughs> my Lord, may I proceed? Yeah, yeah, may fine. I, uh, fine. Um, rephrase or deal with other aspects? No, no, I'm not stopping okay. you. No, no, I understand. I, I'm with you, my Lord, especially in relation to 219. Yes. But I, I, I'm concerned about the relevance of these 205s by the state, but I'll leave it for argument. But let me just put it this way. You gave evidence in terms of section, in terms of exhibit triple G1, where you talk about the towers. And it is your evidence that that number 072 
766-8169. According to the evidence you gave in terms of the distance and the towers, you said that number at that time, uh, I think it was, I'll just confirm it. May I just confirm it, my lord? Why is Mr. Gomez who is confirming, my lord? I think I've got a wing from a case number three that he wants me to pick the other. Okay, fine. fine. Um, Thank you. Man. Just a second, my lord. No, no, no. No, no, no. It was 15 kilometers from the crime scene. Yeah. Yeah. I'll wait for you. Mr. President, I'm sorry to disturb my colleague when he's still busy. Can I just ask for a five minutes adjournment? It's five to one now. We can just consult together with our clients. Just five minutes. Five minutes to one. It's five minutes to one now. Okay, we can adjourn until what time? At 2 o'clock, my lord. You are there at 2. It's my dog. Okay. It's 2 o'clock then. Yeah, it's 2 o'clock.